What's left of the showers from earlier this afternoon is starting to taper off and will stay dry as we head into the overnight. We'll even get a break for the first part of your day on Monday. Showers and storms return into the afternoon. And we're going to hang on to those warm temperatures and even could see some warmer temperatures as we go through the work week. Let's go ahead and take a look at radar, see what's going on across the valley. We are still seeing just a few light showers in northern Trumbull County, uh, just some areas near Mesopotamia. Seeing some very, very light showers, but this drying trend is going to stick around as we go through the next few hours and even for the start of your Monday. As far as rain accumulation from this afternoon, most areas seeing less than one tenth of an inch from the showers earlier today. So here's a look at our next storm system. It's setting up in the upper Midwest. It's going to move through Illinois, Indiana tomorrow and swing through the Ohio as we go late in the day tomorrow. And this storm packing a pretty good punch. Here's a look at the Storm Prediction Center. Outlook for tomorrow. Uh, most of the good instability staying to our, our south and the west, but the valley falling right on the fringe of this and a stronger storm absolutely not out of the question as we go through the late day tomorrow. Parts of Columbiana and Mahoning County falling under the marginal risk. We could see some heavy downpours if we see some uh, thunderstorms setting up late day tomorrow. So, what does this mean for the start of your work week? Mostly cloudy as we head into the overnight. Temperatures falling to the lower 60s. You'll have a dry start to your Monday. Temperatures pretty comfortable as you head out the door tomorrow. The heat is going to return tomorrow and that humidity. It's going to feel muggy tomorrow as we go through the afternoon. That's when we have the best chance of seeing some showers and thunderstorms setting up into the afternoon. Our greatest risk for seeing some more organized showers and storms will come very late Monday night into early Tuesday morning. And those showers and storms will stick around throughout the day on Tuesday. Day. Here's a look at rainfall totals through the day on Tuesday. We're looking at nearly uh, over half of an inch, close to three quarters of an inch in some spots. Areas that see some stronger storms could have uh, some higher totals uh, from the rain through the next few days. So, a lot of wet weather to talk about through the start of the week. Right now, sitting quiet, 67 degrees is the official temperature at the airport. Areas that saw more rainfall this afternoon are sitting a little bit cooler 63 in Minerva, 64 Guilford Lake, 66 in Newcastle. Tonight, temperatures eventually falling to the lower 60s, mostly cloudy and will stay dry uh, for the most part overnight. Tomorrow, you'll stay dry for the start of your day. The best chance for showers and storms into the afternoon. It's going to be a warm one, a high of 80 degrees. Scattered showers likely on Tuesday. We're going to hang on to that unsettled weather, but by Wednesday, we'll start to dry out and that drying trend will stick with us through midweek. By Thursday, partly sunny, high of 82 degrees. Friday, just the slight chance of an isolated shower by Saturday and Sunday. Temperatures ramping up mid to upper 80s and we could even see 90 in some spots next weekend. 